Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. With me in studio today is Patricia Benedict. And she has some updates to give. And for my mind, I it's so hard for me to understand why someone would be so cruel to other human beings. You do not deny a human being water. That's something that everyone needs to have access to. We all need water to live. So to be so callous and to be so heavy handed as to destroy water areas and to make it very hard for residents of Barbados to have water, I find that mind boggling. And Patricia's here to fill you in and to update you and to remind you what you may have forgotten, but this is a very bad situation that's happening in Sunset Crest with a Canadian that is living there. And, and I don't know how the power structure is, but whatever is happening has been allowed to happen. But I'm going to bring Patricia in and she can talk to you about it. Patricia, welcome into the studio. Ms. Veronica, thanks for having me. Before I speak about it, and like I tell people in the comment section, there are people in there to observe certain things and comment too. Can you speak up, please? Okay. Uh, yeah, people are here to observe certain things and the comments, especially and the comments people make in the comment sections about certain things. Now, Ms. Renica, I think since 2018, we've been dealing, dealing with that situation. Now, in 2019, 20, I went in person to the Prime Minister's office to hand deliver documents on that same water. Because I was, like I said, and we did a video about it already, an interview about it, I was the one responsible for the water at that time. What do you mean, re what do you mean responsible for it? Well, the, the, the illegal water, um, 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 t um, water that the, the Canadian was allowed to put um, put there on on the like remove the mains and put illegal water five eight nine ten eleven. I've been there. I went to the Barbados Authority. They admitted. I have the only document. They admitted that they were illegal. Now, Ms. Serenica, I used to the video with the broken taps behind our our the showers and the sinks like you know behind those were done the canadian woman was done that i was allowed to done do that over the years in front of the police in Serenica, in front of the police like kerwin roach and those people in 2019 kerwin roach and, and jason leacock and all those people miss veronica and i have brought documents to the Prime Minister's office. When he retired, the commissioner was deputy commissioner. I went into his because I went down to headquarters and delivered those things where all the the, the, the water bills are in the landowner's name. Ms. Renica, I even too spoke about even the US Embassy would he would be interested in the number eight because the Adelsons were paying, not Adelsons, Urbans were paying money through a, a, a bank from US, the US. And you know the water in number eight was illegal. So that's, you just go figure what it is, Ms. Renica. I don't care what nobody says in the comment section. The Prime Minister has those things, the AG. The US Embassy has those, all the, doc, the documents, the, the doc, I think the documents on that to Ms. Renica. So why is that still allowed to happen? That's a, that is a good question, and, and why why isn't we've talked about this before? It almost seems like deja vu. But why isn't um, Joseph Jordan on the radio with me talking about what what, what what's going on with him? I, I, Miss Renica, he has them in court now. He has the age okay. in court. This is the same thing he has the age in court because these police officers on the. Keith Holiday, Home Affairs Minister with Abraham and the African man, was allowed that lady to do all that nonsense with the water. 
How you could somebody you could come on somebody land and do that? So could she go, could she go to could she could she go to Mia Motley's home and do that? Why why there in Sunset Crest? Why no other home? Why is she able to do it? Because she could have done it. Because you remember I told you PC fourteen fifty four Phillips when I said what I said, what what I meant my intentions were. He said if you if you touch her, you will see what will happen to you. Yeah, but that's not the question though. But okay. No, why no, there? Why why can't example. she do it there? Why is she doing it I there and nowhere example. else? That's, I just give you the example mm -hmm. of all the nonsense they allowed her to do. And but why the there and no one and nowhere else? Because she can. Mm. Because she was allowed to do that nonsense. Because she wants the owner. She wants. They want the land that belongs to the owner. They want everything. They want us to 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 be gone. And the same, some of the same people like number six and, 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 and number fourteen helping her, and, and they don't know if they, they don't know the seriousness of it. If if, if she gets hold of the the, the land and, and the land of Santa Cruz, the, the organization does. He ain't got nowhere. He will not have anywhere. They won't have anywhere. They will have to leave. Right. But Miss Veronica, what? And then I showed you sent your video where. She, well, I sent you a video where she, um, when the, where the, um, I, and I, I said to the prime minister, if she took that water out, you know, but anyway, she did it, Miss Renika. Now, I sent you a video yesterday, of yesterday, Anderson calling was around, pretending that he's sweeping the, the big garbage bins, the big bins sweeping there. He, she sends him to do her dirty job. Now, you know he ain't supposed to be around here. You know, he, he, the second statement, they haven't charged him yet, you know? Right? So he come, I watch him, you know. I did a second video, but because of it, something was inside, I can't share it with people. I said he's lurking. He just come there to monitor. He come to the end, and they're watching up where the pipe was, Miss Veronica. I was watching him all the time. I sent you one video of him in the neighborhood, and I sent the other one to go for them to Mr. Williams. Then a black car was driving up and down. Then this gentleman, either I was supposed to get charged. I sent you a video where Don Pollard was telling him, "Oh, you could do it tomorrow." The same yesterday, I didn't do the, I didn't do that, I didn't take pictures, Miss Veronica. He, he, that car and the woman, old woman in there went around to. They were at the Canadian lady house yesterday, right? Yesterday. This morning, I didn't tell nobody that. That guy came there early this morning, was in my car park. I don't know what he came there for. So he, this evening, I came from court, Miss Veronica, and I see the young boy with seven containers. I was I sent you a picture of it. He was going to the Jordan's condo, um, the, the, the owner's condo to, you know, and I, and I said to myself, what is he going there for? And I look, I went up, and I see the pipe is sealed. It was removed and, and then sealed. And that's similar to the same glue the guy was using for the, the canards, Miss Veronica. And you believe that young boy, he's about eight years, and I, miss, I, I think the young little baby, the child is three, not, not two probably two or three, and the woman has a baby, maybe a year old, you will be deprive those children of water. And and the water really hurt me, and I was crying. I cried this morning, this afternoon. When I asked the young boy, how many stuff, do you have a lot of stuff to, to carry water? No, only six bottles and a bucket, a, 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 a basin, Miss Veronica. Because when I go back there, I am going to make sure that they get those big the, the, some of the stuff I have. I sent you videos of all the pipes that she broke. Miss Renata, that hurt me. That hurt me. And I told him, I told the prime minister, if this lady that does that, she needs to be charged. She needs to be picked up immediately and charged. And if she told Miss Renica, I said in the video, Yesterday, I, I, I um, contacted, I did contact a Canadian uh, media because she's Canadian. 
because I send them a lengthy email because telling them what is going on. And I am going to blame, put some of the blame, and I'm going to blame, question the Canadian consulate, Miss Veronica. I would go that far. She knew what is going on, but I want to know if what connection if she if what connection or if she has any connection with that organization, because what I found a red flag for me, I use I send all emails to all the agencies, the US, Interpol, all the, the, the I didn't send Interpol, but I I say to them, but I emails to British Embassy, all the embassies, and she is telling me, and that's what I did, and that's why I told the Canadian uh, media. She asked me to put it, send it to through her, her, her private email. What does that tell you, Miss Veronica? When the Canadian consulate has a, their own email address, and I want her to be investigated because she knows that. I, although I, I, in fairness to them, the police here has to act first before they do anything. But I want to find out what because she knows I have had private conversations with that Canadian consulate, Miss Veronica. And this lady, Canadian woman, has said she will never get arrested, which was thinking. So I will tell the Prime Minister today. She's gonna get charged. Okay. So no so 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 no okay, wait. So there's a foreigner in Barbados. She's out of Canada and she is in Barbados depriving residents and citizens of water in a place you say is owned by someone else and she does not have the authority to do what she's doing and for some reason it's you're trying to make it make sense and i understand that you you firmly believe what you're saying and because i know you because i am talking to you daily i actually understand what you're saying but i think that people listening they're going to have a challenge it's going to be hard for them to Miss Franca, there's no challenge. Let me tell you something. The Prime Minister has documents. The entire Deputy Commissioner has the documents. I gave it to them myself, right? I gave it to them myself. So this nonsense has to stop today. And all the people in the comment section, oh, listen to me, right? You know the millions of dollars that they said that the Barbados was authorities owed? And not only that, the Prime Minister because of all the, the things that have been going on, she put herself in charge in the Ministry of Water, I don't know what you call them, in January, in January, because of all that nonsense that lady was allowed to do. Now, all the millions of dollars that have been owed, it is part of what they're doing down there in San Segresi now. Because like I said, the, the owner of the land is paying water twice. Who benefits from when you have number five, eight, nine, ten, eleven that has illegal water pipes? Nobody cannot put illegal water pipes. Remove the main. And I want people to understand something clearly. Remove the main four condos to one of the mains, Miss Veronica. Remove it and put water to her tenants or who she wants to and deprive the tenants of the other people the the, the, the landowner no water and the Barbados Water Authority allowed her to do that? Nah Miss Renica I have this gentleman in internal affairs and as they know I do not hide nothing from the Prime Minister the, the AG, none of them. They, they know. They, but I've, I've they seen know. I've seen comments that say that Joel Jordan owes money to the water department. No, Miss Veronica, he doesn't. Okay. He doesn't. You know all the condos in Flamboyant Avenue, every single one, even the light bill he's paying for. The light bill he's paying for all them condos because in the instance those condos and the, the those they were supposed to be not supposed to be at time share. I used to make videos of nobody is in the condo and the air condition is running. This is why I don't know how much electricity those cameras, these things. You remember a gentleman made a comment? Get at Patricia at all costs. Oh. Those cameras, you tell me that they don't they don't take a lot of current? Who you think you be paying for it? None of them are paying for it. So it stops though because they know. So who's paying for it? I, don't, I can't imagine Joe Jordan paying for that. He, he is. He is. I have like 
this in this. I, I have the light there too. I have the light so and, and, and so in what world would someone put something up like that on someone's property and they make the person pay for the light bill? In what world would this happen? How how could because the the electrical companies, the the the, the, the telephone companies are involved in that nonsense with that lady Miss Veronica, and nobody can tell me what going on. And it's why they have to investigate. Those people have Wi-Fi. Um, what's that thing name? Something get assured or something? Is looking for the money to 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 think for number eight uh, errands ever since, and nobody can pay them. them Pro looking for the money. Pro in looking for so, the so, money. So 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 you're saying that someone has come from Canada and invaded an area in Sunset Crest and. Within that invasion, they make Joe Jordan pay for water and pay for electricity while, while they're doing yes. what they're doing? Because it's timeshare, yes, yes. And she's allowed, what she's allowed, what she's allowed to do, she's allowed to have illegal pipes and paying twice. Who is benefiting, and I've asked the Prime Minister that who is benefiting for those illegal water mains if she, if the Prime Minister give the order to remove and she can and she should because they are very illegal so is there is okay with everything you say and that you firmly believe is there anything that you think that if you had more information you could understand better what's going on or do you think that you have it all understood i have all the information okay i have documents and, and notes and, and and unfortunately you know things have happened to me in my, my some of my videos right I, and those people you can you imagine watching me the police officers over the years have so so this 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 there's nothing that they can say to you or present to you that can show you that there's some legality in what they're doing nothing okay. nothing I, i'm packed down okay and i went to i have even evidence and i gave it to them already i have evidence when i go to barbados what authority and they admitted five eight nine ten eleven are illegal and they disconnected it miss renica she had her people connected it back you see i took the video she have locks in them what i told the barbados what authority that they said nobody should have locks on any of those pipes and they're aware of it but they still allow her to do it mm -hmm. but and the Prime Minister got to give the order today. I ain't suggesting nothing because I am going to legally go to Plan B overseas. I am legally, and Miss Veronica, trust me, I have backup. I have backup. And they know, they know part of who I can I, I can I can reach out to. And that lawlessness got to stop. And I want them to investigate. And I want when the media from overseas in, in, investigate that Canadian consulate and Lillian or whatever name in, investigate her. This is lawlessness. You're depriving people and live in Barbados water and those women and free kids, young kids. And imagine you you can imagine I have I have about sixty or seventy of those bottles that young boy have, Miss Renica. Three big ones, buckets. And Boy telling me if I oh I I I my water come up from my eye. He told me they only have six bottles, Miss Veronica, and a basin, and four people, and three is kids. I just use a lot of water, Miss Veronica. Can you imagine those people? There's a fifty, and you. I will not let nobody when you see those three kids there, eh? or they don't speak to us, Miss Veronica, mm -hmm. and that's the prerogative. But you see, when it comes to those children there. Eh? Nobody is not going to deprive them of no water. She's got to get picked up and charged because I done talking to anybody around here. And you know what? What has been really upset the media in Barbados? A lot of them involved in, in, in those people. So hence the, big the media, the, the media, the media is involved. The media. It's involved, or are, are they involved, or are they just turn a blind eye? There's a, there's a difference. Veronica, they did so much things for the organization. <coughs> Listen me. to me. They did so much things for the organization, and and to, I would ask for sponsor. But before that, I will I will let Miss Eula King ask for sponsor from y'all, and I will sit down and show y'all 
a lot of things. Media, you see the media? You see the media? A lot of the medias are to blame for all those things that's happening because they turned a blind eye and they were part of it. Most of the CEOs of the media, they get paid to turn a blind eye. A lot of them get paid to turn a blind eye. So the, the average reporter, there's some good reporters, don't get me wrong, cannot, they go to school or whatever to, to learn to do journalism and stuff, cannot do their work properly because the CEOs, some of the CEOs are fattening their pockets and, 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 and they are barely getting scrams, um, crumbs because the CEO said, oh, you can't do that. We, Massey is sponsoring us. So most of them are sponsoring Massey too. Massey is the problem. Massey is the problem. Hoffman is the problem. Austin Hickey is the problem. You know what I'm saying? All those people are the problem. Now they are big guys in that organization, like Robert Andrew Armstrong, aka Andy Armstrong, Bernie Weatherhead, who was once a president. They got a lot of big people in there. Don't get that. And some of the government and opposition people are involved, you know. You know what I tell you? Some of the ones, not only all my friends, Minister Wilfred Abraham in the Prime Minister, in the Prime Minister, in um, Barbados Labour Party involved, you know. And some of the opposition, because a lot of the people in the opposition, some of them are funded by those people, you know. I know what I'm talking about. But that lawlessness stop, stops, so that lawlessness stops. Because when the big boys, big boys have to come in now. The big boys have to come in. Because I told him about the media. I said the media is part of the problems down here. They turn a blind eye. But Miss the best job, Miss Veronica. But it's the same media. You know how many people have come to me, Miss Veronica, and told me, I don't want to put away from the subject. Come to me and told me that they went to the media, they went to the nation, they went to CBC, and the news, they said, oh, we can't do this, or we can't, we can't post this, or we can't do that. Can you imagine? And Miss Benedict got to do that. Miss Benedict got to do it, and I am not no part of the media, but you know what? I love my people, and I will not, never let anybody unfair nobody. So when people come in the comment section, you're malicious or this and that, it is not that, you know. People call me, people come to me, and I have to respond in a way to help people, and I will, will not continue. I will continue doing it. But that lawlessness is going to stop. And the people in the comment section, oh, you don't own this. I have a man show me the tax bill. He gonna pay taxes on the land. Remember, I did a video in the, in the when the the organization said, oh, they haven't received a tax bill in years. What does that tell you? Which organization that don't receive it haven't received a tax bill in years, Miss Veronica? Because they don't own anything. But it's subsidy, though. She's got to get picked up. She, I am no the bones about it. And I will tell the Prime Minister something else. And I, I have also said in private messages and I send emails when I see to the U.S. Embassy and everybody. The problem is you got to remove the water in five, nine, eight, five, eight, nine ten and eleven and that foolishness will be stopped in that area that is the problem and if the owner has them in court what does that tell you miss veronica yeah he has an ag in court for the same water they they they, they, they remove not only them pipes the whole thing they remove the whole thing that made a big news and and the other uh, 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 media outlets it stops legally it stops and you know why she's vexed too i will tell you why she's vexed to miss veronica she sees me going and get that same water she, she doesn't like to see me going and get water okay? she looks at the mirror the, the cameras and sees me because she saw me yesterday getting a lot of it so she don't like that and that's wickedness miss veronica wickedness and, and we got to, um, you know, the thing you did yesterday about um, her daughter sending you mail. Mm -hmm. People thinking it's me that 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 she thing, but it wasn't me. It's Miss Veronica. 
You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah. What? Okay. See, so they thought, yeah, they thought it was me, but not me. So Miss okay. Veronica, but I have a story for her. She did it. She, she kept on calling my phone, Kaija, Kaija. But I don't want to in front of the subject, Miss Veronica. Okay. It stops. So it stops today. It stops today because yesterday I sent an email already out to the one Canadian me, and I will push it. I will get more and push it, and every day I will keep on nagging them. Not nagging them, but, yeah, but continue emailing them, emailing them, and then I will go to I would um, contact the person in, in uh, that that um, at the internal phase. Okay. So because see. because because they actually had me to add on to the email, so that was easy. Because instead of them calling, I calling them, I did I did to the the, the the email. So I have the plan plan B, and and if if the prime minister refuses, because you heard a video when I said to her, you thought you you, you thought you, uh, you 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 could tell the prime minister what to do this and that. You remember she said the prime minister have no say in Santa Cruz. You know she said so something similar. Yeah, but but let's stick to this but particular said, show. But that's what she you, you have you have a Canadian in Santa Cruz doing as she likes. And you say that you 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 are on top of things, and what she's doing is illegal. And you know it from all aspects of what you know. You believe that you're correct that she's doing something illegal. Yeah. Yet within the the, the uh, I within the eyes of the police and everyone else, she seems to have a legal right to do it. So where do we where where do we go from there? I'm going to plan B, Miss Veronica. Okay. I go into plan B. If she's not picked up today or this week, I go. And not only that, too, she's upset, Miss Veronica. You know why she's upset too? Because I have shocked the the um the court and the police when I I gave the I sent a short message to the Prime Minister and and I went down there and when Clark had to sign a document to have her appear in court okay. for my trolley. Well, so I have something to say no. about I have something to say about the Canadian. It seems as though she works twenty four seven because I have lived and I prop I vow never to do it again. But I have lived in a area where there was an association, and come the weekend, come Friday evening, that office is closed and you don't hear anything from them until the Monday. But with this particular Canadian, she's she's out all hours of the night, every day, Saturday, Sunday, she all the day, all the time. In the years before, she has been out from five o'clock. She has been sitting in a car four five a.m. in the morning, Miss Renika, looking at us. She has had. So it's more. It's more than just a job. That's what I'm saying. It's more than just a job. There's something wrong here. There's something just you know doesn't what the guy add up. Said in the comment section, Patricia Benedict at all costs. Mm. Remember? Yeah. So somebody is funding them because I am the problem. Yeah, there's, 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 it's I more than just it's, it, it is more than just a job for her. It is more than just a job because yeah. usually people wait for five o'clock to reach and they say I'm done I'm, I'm shutting down and you don't hear from them until the next day I'm the problem I am the problem there I am the one because if I am not there they have full access and they would actually have the owner removed and everybody else and they because don't forget listen I've been up different um, a few times a, a few months ago the police still went and tell the man to remove his car and the thing so it's a money thing they are promised if the petition petition is no longer in Santa Cruz, they get paid big, half hefty because then they put the owner in prison. They will find, they will manufacture something because you see what Wonder Blair want to give him um um found him guilty. I will talk about that too because I know Miss Miss for fact Miss Wonder Blair is part of that that, okay. that, 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 that 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 organization. Okay. So they want to find him guilty. They want to sentence him. So when he's out of the out of the way, they kind of have control, and she's deeply involved. And I will speak about Wonder Blair, and I think she needs to be fired, Miss Veronica. Okay, we're going so to we're, we're going, going to half an hour. I, we are going yeah. to half an hour on the show. Let's let's land plane, please. This cannot continue to happen. She is telling the prime minister, "I am in control." of Barbados. I'm in control of San Secret. Like she said, the Prime Minister can't tell her how when it comes to San Secret, the Prime Minister has no say. That is what she's continues telling her. She said it. 
to a certain extent on a video. So that is what she's telling the prime minister because she has a lot of people to back it up. Now, if she's not arrested, like her daughter was arrested before, and I'm going to talk about it. You remember you talk about Lalu, whatever the white man name? Yeah. Well, that's another story. If she's not arrested, it tells me a lot. Okay. It tells me a lot, Miss All Veronica. right. Well, thank you. Thank you, Patricia. Well, thank you very much. You're welcome. This is Sherry Veronica, Naked Departure Radio. This is the 5th of June, um, 2024. It's about quarter past 12, roughly. The pipe is still on. The gentleman went behind, went at Tina's house. So let me see if the pipe will, will disappear. Guys. Look. Let me move in the, the, the. Can you see it? She had the pipe lock off. Lock off. Sewed on. And if only person too that was doing work like this yesterday is the same guy that fixed up the the um guttering he had stuff to glue glue on to two things he had stuff to glue on to this this stuff so they got to they got to take him and anderson calling and her see now i'm going back over there the little boy told me i asked the little boy does he have any water? No, the, no the, the, the children are, I think, one and three, and he's nine, eight or nine. I asked the young boy if he has any water. Room. He had to have a little basin. Four people, you know, three are kids, and then maybe nine years old, one year old, three years old, probably two years old, because the, the, that kid didn't children look too young to be four. She looked too young to be four. Right? It's too young to be to, to be um so one three uh and probably the guy not bully boy night they ask him they tell me they only have seven bottles guys seven bottles and all of them the guy little boy had all of them by the pipe to collect water and he ain't get no water i tell him you don't have any water at home he tell me they have a basin so they didn't have many buckets and stuff, but I have a lot of stuff I could give them, right? Let me show you what the bottles look like the boy had on. One of these. You see what I have out there? One of those. He only have seven of these. They only have seven and a basin. Seven and a basin. For an, an eight-year-old, a three-year-old, and a one-year-old, and a mother, and you would tell me, right? The prime minister can't give no order to have that woman pick up and charge. The prime minister can't do it. The prime minister can't do it. And all the legal water she have in number five, number eight, number nine, number ten, number eleven should be removed immediately they ain't got nobody in there now removed immediately because i have made contact with people from canada the um media and i think i i i would have to go uh and but not only that too help me spread the word about naked departure via social media subscribe and share to show support and love for our channels